Hey guys, it's Grand Admiral Thrawn, and today I'm doing a review of a figure in person. This is something I haven't done in a while, so I'm glad to get back to it. Anyway, today's figure is Peacemaker from the DC 7-inch scale figures. And wow, just look at this figure. I mean, just look at that detailing. It's so good. I mean, just wow. Pat yourselves on the back. This figure is amazing. I mean, just look at the weapons, everything. And it looks just like John Cena. Oh, wait. Oops. Sorry. Here's the figure. Couldn't see him. Anyway, yeah, that was a dumb joke. Okay. Now, yeah, what I just said is actually what applies to this figure. It's got great detail. Looks just like John Cena. It's just like the movie. And then it's got great posability. Uh... Yeah, it's a good figure. It comes with this little stand. It also came with a card of Peacemaker and a box. I still have the card, but I don't need to bring it out for this. And then, now let's get into some uh, negatives about this figure. One negative is that he has a sword. Now, he only has a sword like once or twice in the movie, and I don't even think he has one at all in his show. So yeah, I feel like he should have had a gun or something instead is all, and uh, they do the same thing with the Bloodsport one, where they give it him a, two swords instead of guns. I don't even think Bloodsport uses swords in the movie. He might actually, but if he does, it's not memorable at all, because he does it like maybe once or twice. Anyway. Um, yeah, it looks just like John Cena, and it's got great coloring. It's just a great figure, and it's pretty tall. Um, yeah, I don't have the box here, so I won't be including points on that, like I do with Black Series, but the card is good, so I will be including that. I don't actually have the card here, like I stated, but yeah, this is a good figure for posability. And if you want play features, yeah, this is a good figure, too, because weapons, um... This is not from The Peacemaker Show. They have not made any for his show yet, but they have made for The Suicide Squad. And they are Peacemaker, Bloodsport, Harley Quinn, and Polka Dot Man. And then when you get all four of them, they can combine and make a King Shark figure, who I used in my last video of the King Shark versus Spider-Man. Stop motion. But uh, yeah, this is a good figure, and if you find it and you like Peacemaker, I would recommend that you get it. It's up to you, though. Um, he is a bit expensive, being like $33, I think he was, but it's still a good figure. Plus, you get, um, I think Peacemaker was the one arm, or maybe he was the legs. I can't remember what Peacemaker was. I know, I don't wait, no, yeah, he was the one arm. Yeah, he was an arm that you get when you get this one. And yeah, it's a good figure, and I really recommend that you get it. This is Grand Admiral Thrawn. So oh, wait, sorry, I forgot. Overall score. I would give this figure a... Hmm. I don't know. I'm thinking like an 8 out of 10, because he never really uses a sword in the movie or show. And then also... Um... It doesn't exact. I don't have the box here, but I remember what they look like, and they weren't all that special. Every figure looks like that, but it's still a great figure, otherwise I wouldn't have got it. And yeah, this is Grand Admiral Thrawn signing off.